for our meditation, because it's, that's where at the time of the service that we're moving into right now. And for most of you are aware that we did a Love Blooms uh, con contribution this year to where you had an opportunity to give a love offering in any amount in honor of someone that you care about that's living or in memory of someone that's important in your life. And so right now, to start our meditation, I want to read those names to you. And so I know sometimes this can be grueling. You don't know 99% of these names. But I want you to realize that these names mean something to someone. So I would like you, thank you, I'm going to look for, I got it. There we go. So, Yvette's going to play some background to this as I start the reading of the names. Are we ready here? Yes. Okay. So, we're going to start with those names that were, that were filled out and sent in in honor of. So, to my spiritual family at Unity of Garden Park that was given by me because I'm so grateful. To our awesome audio team that was submitted by Nudge, our captain back there. Janet and Byron Weller, given by Michael Weller and Kathy Englehart. Norman and Joyce Penley, given by their daughter Sandy Malloy. Rev Kathy and Jack Casto, given by Joyce DeVos. Roberta and Tom Thorpe, given by Cindy Flatt. Martha Clark, given by Judith Oney. Paul Lloyd, given by Beth Lloyd. Jean Vaughn and family, given by Beth Vaughn. To the Unity of Garden Park media team, Connie Frecking, Kathy Mountain, Tony Bodnick, and Julie Porter. These are all committed volunteers, given in by Sandy Malloy. Karen McNichol, given by her sister, Ann Welton. Annette DeCress, Lawson, Bibi Vandaka, and Erin Clendenin. That's given by Michelle DeCress. Rev Kathy, given by Sandy Bolhauer and Sue Ellen Steubing. George and Donna Craby, given by Debbie, Chiffon, Kayla, and Donovan. And now we're going to move into those donations and poinsettias that were given in the names of people who have passed on in someone's life. Richard E. and Alma Thomas, given by Leslie Porter. Lisa Porter and Hadia, Hadia Porter. Leslie, given by Leslie Porter. John and Marie Virgin. Ralph and Virginia Meyer, given by Don and Vicki Meyer. Robert Mountain, Jr., given by Kathy Mountain. Reverend Richard Bevins and Miss Betty, Mrs. Betty Bevins, given by Joyce DeVos. Tom DeVos and Steve Slusher, given by Joyce DeVos. Leon and Barbara Hickerson, given by Cheryl Hickerson. Barbara and Michael Griswold, given by Angie Griswold. Joanne and Bill Harrington, given by Kim and Tom Lee. Betty and Harry Lee, given by Kim and Tom Lee. Edna and Paul Lindsay, given by Shelley Lindsay. Ella McDowell and William McGill, given by Shelley Lindsay. Donald Miles Haley and Richard Tomaskovic, I'm sorry, given by Mary Haley. Lynn Frank, given by Tom, Dean, and Tommy Frank. Josepha, Bill, and Lillian New, given by Dot Kemper. Ted and Jean Bonanami, given by Gary and Doris Bonanami. Frank and Evan Va Eva Vass, Frank and Eva Vass, given by Susan Vass. Diane Sandman, my dear sister given by Lynn Mayo. 
Winona Myers, given by Judith Oney. Barbara Lloyd, given by Beth Lloyd. Uncle Kenny Weaver, given by Uncle Steve, Aunt MB, and Alexis. Christopher James Shaw, given by Uncle Steve, Aunt MB, and Alexis. Rosella and Victor Lachat, given by Sue Crisby. Vicki, is that Spangenberger, given by Sue Crisby. Bob and Dee Kreidler, given by Kathleen and Fred Jacobs. Lewis and Mildred Jacobs, Richard and Lucille Berkey, given by Kathleen and Fred Jacobs. Richard and Lucille Berkey, I already said that, given by Kathleen and Fred. Virginia Schill, my mother, given by Nancy and Bill Schill. Dave Jordan and Larry Langdon, given by Sandy Langdon. Silvana Sabato, given by, I'm sorry, Barbara Arnold, given by Silvana Sabato. Yvonne Schmorzer, Dave Jordan and Larry Langdon, given by Dave Schmoiser. Don Busmeyer, given by Connie Busmeyer. Roy and Della Garrison, given by Ann Welpton. Phyllis and George DeCress, Terry Grothwall, Dennis Spencer, and Ted Mallow, given by Michelle DeCress. Our beloved pets, Bubby, Tuffy, and Bistro, given by Michelle DeCress. Jim and Alice King, given by Katie Kitten Prechter. Jerry Lynn Spearing, given by Mom and Dad. Grandma Audrey, Grandpa Teddy, Aunt Dory, and Aunt Louise, given by Debbie Wilhelm and Chris Tacoby. Marvin Smith, given by Susan Cannon and Rick Smith. Arnold and Shirley Sevier, Lyle and Jean Barnes, Samantha Griff, given by the Barnes family. Sweet Tom, Tammy, Nick, Matt, TCM3, and all of our past pets with much love, the Barnes family. Charles and Mary Cannon, given by Susan Cannon. Bud Wukasik, given by Elizabeth Wukasik. Randy Elliott, Mary Elliott, and Mike Elliott, given by Greg, Julie, Chloe, and Coleman Porter. And I hope I say this right, Signe, and Jim Jennings and Scott Hartman, given by Paula Hartman. Amy Gages, given by Sandy Gages. Ruth Godel Detmer, Ray Detmer, and Lou Godel, given by Jane Godel. Priscilla Casto, given by Jack Casto and Vicki Casto. Florence Bullhauer, Rose, and Erwin Steubing, given by Sue Ellen Steubing and Sandy Bullhauer. Marvin Smith, given by Susan Cannon and Rick Smith. Joe and uh, Gerald Higgins, Meredith Nickel, Teresa Wenzel, and Ronald Wenzel, given by Joe and Julia Higgins. Martin and Sally Cap, given by Vicki Cap. Janice and Joseph Doring, given by Barb Doring. MacArthur and Arthur Lean Modem. Barbara Yance, given by Bill and Herlene Yance and the family. Tracy Comer, Pat Pfeffenberger, and Terry Allies. At the Allays, I'm sorry. Bill and given by Bill and Herlene Yance and the family. Jamalia Yaya Pringle, given by Chiffon, Debbie, Kayla, and Donovan. James Thomas, given by Beverly McLaughlin. Bobby Henderson, given by Todd Henderson. Justin Duncan and Aaron Losey, given by Carolyn Duncan. Gerd and Bob O'Connor and Steve Schreiber, given by Irene O'Connor and Linda Schreiber. Dave Jordan 
and Larry Langdon, given by Brian and Amy Jordan. Bob and Doris, the best mama and pops ever, given by Susie. And Brian Elliott, given by Diane Elliott. I want you to just take a breath in, in honor of all of them. Just take a nice, easy breath. It's a lot of names, wasn't it? A lot of names. A lot of people missing loved ones and a lot of people in gratitude for loved ones. So I'd like us to just sing a verse of Silent Night together. continue with that. We light the Advent wreath and today let's start with the beginning of Advent where we lit the candle of hope and faith. And then on the second week of Advent we moved into peace. And last week Reverend Sandy led you into the third week of Advent, which was the Advent Sunday of love. And today, we celebrate our fourth Sunday of Advent by lighting the candle of joy. And so, as I go back to the word for the daily word today of joy, I want you to just Take a breath in and close your eyes for just a moment. As we celebrate all those names that were read today, and we celebrate all of those who gave poinsettias and donations in memory and in honor of all those names. We celebrate hope, faith. We celebrate peace. We celebrate love as we move into the final week of Advent to Christmas Day. I want you to just very quickly in your mind's eye, I want you to find something that you are joyful about. Just one thing that you are joyful about at this moment. And go ahead and start listing some more if you come up with more. You're here. Be joyful. You got up, you suited up, and you showed up today. Just take a nice moment to bask in the season of Advent. For this is a holy season. It is a holy life. It is a holy day.
As you take a nice easy breath in, I want you to start to bring your awareness back to this space. Know that all is well. All is well and it is whole.